students how are you all i hope you all are fine and staying safe at home children in this module number 2 we are going to talk about the air pollution what is the air pollution yes you are right air pollution is nothing it has the harmful gases or the dust or the smoke or any other particles that makes the air dirty that is known as the air pollution and we are all aware about it that how does it cause but still we will talk about it so we are going to talk about the causes of air pollution so basically there are two types of causes of air pollution one is natural and another one is man made yes you are right you heard it right the natural and the man made so yes children we are going to talk about the natural first what are the natural causes of uh, air pollution in this first is sandstorms and what are sandstorms sandstorms are nothing if you, if you have seen it in the movies and all you have seen there the area which has a desert there the air comes with a lot of speed and with along with a lot of dust so that is the sandstorm next is the volcanic eruption volcanic eruptions you have not seen it i know this but you have seen it in the movies or the hollywood movies you can say so in that lot of uh, lava comes out of the volcano and volcanoes are basically in japan if you will talk about so they are the uh, kind of hills right and it has lot of uh, lava in it when it gets erupted then all that lava comes out then we have another cause that is the forest fire i hope you all remember that that we had a forest fire in our sariska jungles also above the bala pila do you remember that the last year or might be the last and last year there was a forest fire and lot of smoke was coming out of it and that creates a choking in the environment and we feel very choked because the air contains lot of smoke with it right so that is also the cause of air pollution and that is the natural nobody has done the uh, fire in it right in the jungle but it happens automatically so that is the natural air pollution cause then we have the pollen grains so children what are pollen grains have you seen have you seen flowers blooming and the flowers bloom in the season of spring in that spring some people start sneezing some people start coughing and lot of problems are there in the uh, atmosphere right the people started feeling like choking why because the flowers and the plants which has the pollens they get scattered away in the with the air and that creates a choking and a sneezing like problems in humans and that is also one of the causes of the air pollution now let us come to the man made pollution uh man made causes of pollution so first is can you please tell me one of the one of the two yes you are right the human has made the factories right so factories the smoke coming out of the factories that creates a air pollution so factories are not made naturally they are made by us so that is also one of the cause of the air pollution if we talk about second is the vehicles right children you know that this that vehicles emit some smoke when their engine gets burnt right when the engine gets uh, burnt so that creates a air pollution so i tell you one more thing about it children you might have asked your parents to 
टेक अ राइड इन अ कार वेन यू आर अलोन यू कैन आस्क योर पेरेंट्स टू गो ऑन अ बाइक विद यू इफ यू वॉन्ट अ राइड राइट दैट विल बी द वाइज डिसीशन टू सेव अर अर्थ फ्रॉम द एयर पोल्यूशन नाउ द थर्ड कॉज वॉट डू यू थिंक वॉट विल बी द थर्ड कॉज येस बर्निंग ऑफ फ्यूल्स that comes into the vehicles also but sometimes that also uh happens in some mines or in some factories like when coal gets burnt right or some other materials or the some other fossil fuels get burnt that also causes the air pollution so that is the burning of fuels any burning of fuel it causes the air pollution right now what do you think what will be the next the next is that you do and what was that that you do on dipavli yes you catch it right it's the fire crackers the fire crackers which you burn on diwali right the fire crackers that you burn on diwali that also causes lot of air pollution so children that is why every year you have been suggested and told that you should not use fire crackers very much you can use little bit right aap thoda sa use kar sakte ho fire crackers ko diwali par bahut zyada karne se air pollution hota hai is that clear i hope it is very clear now children there is one more serious thing of the air pollution that is happening a lot in in this scenario especially if we talk about that is the smog what is the smog let me explain it to you smog so smog is nothing what is the smog so let us talk about the smog first smog is mixture of smoke plus fog Generally, you see this kind of condition. The weather, uh, the atmosphere becomes cloudy, and we feel like as if it can be a rain. But that is not the time that it will get a rain. So that is the mixture of smoke, smoke and fog. This happens generally in the metropolitan cities like Gurgaon, Delhi, Chennai, Bombay, right? Mumbai, you can say. So this creates a lot of a kind of blanket you can say or kind of environment you can say where the people get feeling like choked right lot of black black particles comes over our clothes that is the smog and that is really very dangerous for the people especially who are suffering from asthma or from bronchitis or from any other disease which is related to the uh you can say the breath uh, related to the breath right people feel like choking and they are unable to breathe properly right so that is how the air pollution is caused so we should be very aware about it and we should reduce the air pollution as much as we can thank you and have a nice day children we are going to talk about one one of the other uh, cause of air pollution that is the smog 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 is nothing it is a mixture of smoke plus fog in this it looks like the weather is cloudy but what happens is that smoke gets mixed up with the fog and it makes the environment hazy and that is known as the air that is one of the cause of the air pollution children that is that is also uh, very harmful for the plants the plants get retardation in their growth retardation means ki unki growth kam ho jati hai they don't get proper nutrients of course where there is a air pollution the plants will not be able to grow properly they will not be able to give you the healthy uh, you can say the healthy air back because you are not uh, because because of the air pollution the plants are not getting the healthy nutrients so that is why plant growth also get retarded and the growth becomes 
slow and the growth slows down so we should be very very careful about the air pollution and we should try to reduce the air pollution as much as we can dear students let us know more about air pollution through this presentation so what is air pollution can you see from the picture yes the smoke coming out of the factories cars rockets or you can say the firecrackers etc that all causes the air pollution so what is air pollution the mixing of harmful gases dust smoke and other particles in the air is air pollution so you can see various pictures i have put up here so that you can understand it better so in the first picture you can see lot of smoke a uh, lot of gases are coming out of the buildings and lot of smoke is coming out of the forest etc so these are the different names of the gases which is coming out like n2o co2 and o3 right so this you will learn in your future classes then can you see this person is sneezing in this picture why because lot of dust is coming out of this vehicle right as well as the sand is coming up from this vehicle now in the last picture you can see lot of smoke is coming out of the factories as well as from the vehicles so this is how the air pollution is caused now let us understand the different causes of the air pollution although you have seen it in your classroom recording but still we will discuss some of them here also right so you can see the factories you can see the construction work you can see the houses and the buildings you can see uh, the vehicles you can see the uh, flowers right or the uh, plants they they are giving the pollens and these pollens also causes the air pollution so let us understand it better so natural causes of air pollution are sandstorms i have already discussed it that lot of sand when comes with a high speed of air then it is known as the air pollution and that is the sandstorm actually which causes the air pollution right then we have the volcanic eruption so when the lava comes out from the volcano then it also uh, causes the air pollution then we have the forest fires then we have the pollens yes so the pollens from the flowers that uh, that is harmful for many of the people and uh, the people can have the sneezing coughing cold from this so that is also why because it carries it is one of the cause of the air pollution okay now let us understand what are the human made factors for air pollution so you can see in the first picture this is the factory then the vehicles on the roads then uh, these are the mines right the smoke or you can say the burning of the fuel where from where the smoke is coming out right and then we have the fire crackers which is one of the biggest cause of air pollution okay so this we have already discussed in our classroom teaching that what is a smog right so smog is the mixture of smoke plus fog so this picture will give you the better understanding about the smog so can you see the picture of india gate before smog that means you can see everything very beautifully right everything is very clear crystal clear but if you will see here after the smog the you cannot see the people even properly you can see even the you cannot see even the gate properly so this this becomes the hazy hazy matlab dhundla ho gaya right so this is what is smog and it is also one of the cause of the air solution thank you and have a nice day i hope uh, it is very clear to you now what is what is air pollution and what are the causes of air pollution so and as we have discussed in in our classroom teaching that air pollution causes lot of diseases also like asthma bronchitis etc etc